Determination of Artificial Sweeteners by HPLC Sample Preparation You're provided with the following stock solutions. From these stock solutions you'll be required to make dilution from each standard solution. Obtain three 10 ml volumetric flasks and label them with the appropriate standard. Using an auto pipette, take a 1 ml aliquot of the standard solution and dispense it into the corresponding 10 ml volumetric flask. Fill the flask up with distilled water until approximately 1 cm under the calibrated mark. Using a bulb pipette, make up to the mark dropwise until the bottom of the meniscus sits just on top of the calibrated line. Mix well. You're also provided with a mix standard containing 20 parts per million theophylline, 40 parts per million of caffeine and a 50 parts per million of benzoate. This mix standard does not need to be diluted. Next you need to prepare your soft drink samples. Pour some soft drink into a beaker until approximately half full. Place the sample into a sonic bath and run the bath for one minute to degas the sample. If after one minute the sample still contains visible bubbles, run the bath again for one minute and proceed to do this until all the bubbles have been removed. You'll need to make a 1 in 50 and a 1 in 100 dilution of each of the soft drinks. Dispense one milliliter of the soft drink into a 50 milliliter volumetric flask and another one milliliter into a 100 milliliter volumetric flask. The samples also require a 20 parts per million theophylline in each flask to act as an internal standard. Calculate the amount of the initial theophylline stock solution required to achieve this concentration in the appropriate volumetric flasks. Make the flasks up to the mark using distilled water. Mix well. Prior to analysing the samples on the HPLC, you are required to filter the samples using a syringe and membrane. Remove the filter from the syringe and pull out the plunger. Replace the filter on the end of the syringe. Pour approximately 5 millilitres of the sample into the syringe. Replace the plunger into the syringe and push the plunger down slowly so that the sample passes through the membrane filter. Discard the first few mils of the eluent and then collect the rest of the eluent in a sample bottle. Make sure you label the bottles with the corresponding sample. The standard solutions and the samples are now ready to be analysed on the HPLC.